physical properties of metals and non metals before starting the lecture click on the subscribe button and get access to our hundred of conceptual lectures for free firstly let me teach you about the classification of metals and non metals in the periodic table well this line separate metals from non metals the elements at the left side of this line are metals for example like sodium calcium and zinc are metals while the elements at the right side of this line are non metals like carbon fluorine and neon are non metals now what are the physical properties of metals well all metals are solid at room temperature except mercury for example iron is metal and solid at room temperature while the mercury we use in thermometer is metal and liquid secondly metals have luster it means that metals are shiny for example gold is very shiny metal thirdly metals are good conductor of heat and electricity for example copper wires are good conductor of current and we use them in our daily life while we also use metallic pots for cooking because they are good conductor of heat fourthly ductility metals are ductile it means that metals can be made into wires for example copper is a metal we make long copper wires for conduction of current and electricity this property of metal is called ductility fifthly malleability metals are malleable it means that metals can easily be shipped without breaking for example using hammer we convert iron into long shields also remember that comparatively metals have high density they are hard and heavy now what are the physical properties of non metals well non metals are often gases at room temperature but there are some exceptions for example bromine is a non metal and liquid at room temperature carbon and iodine are non metals and solid at room temperature secondly non metals are dull it is because they do not reflect light very well for example charcoal is very dull thirdly non metals are insulators are bad conductor of heat and electricity for example plastic is a non metal it doesn't conduct heat and electricity but there are some exceptions for example carbon in the form of graphite or pencil can conduct electricity fourthly non metals are brittle it means that non metals are not easy to bend without breaking for example consider a glass you cannot bend a glass without breaking it so we therefore say that non metals are brittle also remember that comparatively non metals are less denser they are usually light are not heavy this was all about the physical properties of metals and non metals